all right guys welcome back to the channel so it is about deer season as you guys see there's a tree stand behind us but last two weeks we've been working on that well last week we've been working on that so youth season starts in one week after monday it starts next sunday or saturday so we got the deer stand frame all done so now we gotta get a some metal put on there and then we gotta get the little one she has to shoot the bow so she can uh go get it first deer so you guys stay tuned we'll catch you guys soon as we either put metal on that or her start shooting one of the two so you can catch you guys in a minute all right guys so we're back out here as you can see uh we got some clippers we are siding this deer blind so we gotta get another one cut at 55 inches and climb it back up there such a pain but hopefully we got enough to do another section of it here and then we might be able to do the other the other side of this one and maybe the roof don't know yet so you guys stay tuned don't have a cameraman today so you guys bear with me Yes, I can see you. Alright, so we got this side started. We just got to finish. Just hanging off for dear life. Definitely OSHA approved. Now we got to get a little lower. Got to move the screws. We don't throw them down. Just hopefully we don't fall. This is the easy part. The hard part is this where we have no nothing to hold ourselves. This ain't going nowhere now. Okay, maybe it is. Whew. I'm thinking I'm putting more screws in this than I am my own shed that I built. Is that bad? Mm -hmm. It's chilly in here. Or out here. It's chilly. Chilly? Yes. How about you just hang on? Hang on to what? I ain't got nothing to hang on up here. Tree stands come with those weird if I fall down things. Well, this is ocean approved. It's OSHA, not, not ocean. ocean. This is ocean approved. Why is it ocean? We are no the no water. No water. No ocean. That's exactly the reason why we're ocean approved. Uh, special. We fall, well, we probably ain't going to get back up from it. So special approved. Got uh, it. Said so, so it's special approved. Got it.
things about as sturdy as our government. Uh-huh. Huh? No. Now the bad part is, the bad part is what I'm getting ready to go do. What are you doing now? You gotta hang off the tree stand. Huh. Fun. It's sprinkling. Come on. <laughs> You know what, if you fall, can you at least do it while I'm still here? <laughs> Gotta edit that out. Well, if there's any animals around, they are no longer. Well, I had to get that flat so it didn't flop. Now there's no flop. Here, catch. Rude. All right, guys. So uh, we started to cut that, cut that right there, and I'm gonna have black and white this, but my finger, my cutter slipped, and now I have a big gash. You guys see that? Big gash. So we're gonna go take care of that real quick. Uh, we're gonna throw a Band-Aid on it so I don't get no more metal shavings in it or uh, some dirt and sweat. So you guys stay tuned. All right, so we got the finger all cleaned up. No big deal, just through all the skin. We can work with it. We gotta go back up there, finish cutting that so we can get this done. So you guys stay tuned. All right, guys, so we got the roof on. Missing a little piece of it, but you know what? It'll be okay. They're down there, right there. Look at that deer. Hey, PG-13. I didn't do it. I did not do it. PG-13. Hey. Right. I did not do it. So we got the roof on. Um, oh, 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 oh. We got that piece on. We got to do this piece. Then this piece, then that little piece right there. Then the deer blind, it will be done. Um, I have to go get some netting or something like that so we can put right here. Because I didn't think about that until now. So we'll have to quit pulling on it, you ding dong. <laughs> it's the property line. I knew that. I thought it was in case I get lost. No, you get lost, you're on your own. Tough luck. Anyways, so we gotta do them because this is kind of wide open. 
trying to think if I should put a piece of plastic right here, or plastic, not plastic, piece of metal. So we still got to think on that one. Um, so I'll let you guys see it when we get down. So catch you guys in a flash. Catch! All right, so if you climb up the ladder, and boom, there she is. Uh, yeah, I didn't think about this. Hopefully once I put that on, and once I put the side on. We're going to have something to cover that big gap up. So it doesn't let the heat out. And then we need something to close that up. So... Go comment below on if you guys like this. If you guys do, we gotta build another one. So maybe I will show you guys how I built this so far. But we still have to do that one and the rest of the roof and that other one and she should be done. But then we will have to put netting up. And we gotta blend it in some. Which is good about this is because we can um, we can put the netting on the outside too, so that'll help out too. Because they're black than the netting. So Alright, so with that being said, um I'll probably catch you guys in a minute. In a minute. In a minute. All right, guys. So um, we had some. <laughs> we had some uh, interesting things happen today. So today is Monday. I gotta go back and edit this and put it up. So, anyways, with that being said, uh, we got them on. Them on the other piece of the roof. So the deer stand is completely done sides for the netting for the back and something to block this big hole and the big hole right there but anyways so as i was walking in you know i cut this i cut this with a grinder literally 100 yards behind me which is my garage not far not far from my home. But, um, I walked in here with that piece, and there was a doe standing right, right about there, right over there, right, right about there. It's all right. I stopped. I waited. She walked. She walked up there, then back down there, and then walked across here and disappeared. Okay. So, with that being said, so I was like, okay, I, and then I climbed up here put this on made a whole bunch of noise like a whole bunch of noise like kids with the uh, pots and pans with wooden spoons beating against stuff so with that being said um i was like oh i ain't gonna see any more deer so i cut these and then i was like well i'll come back out put them up real quick so it's done and it can sit here for two weeks because we are not gonna go youth hunting We've been working with Ella, and uh, I don't just don't think she has the confidence to shoot a deer confidently. So, with that being said, it's just going to be me and you guys for this year, unless we can get somebody else. But anyways, so cut them to made a whole bunch of noise, beating and banging, walked out here. And the buck that I have for Ella was literally standing right at that base of that tree. Like, really? Come on. I need, I need some type of break here. Like, after I beat all this up here... And it still came? What the heck? But anyways, might be a short short, short story. <laughs> might be a short video. Um, sorry, uh, just had to get this done. Seems pretty sturdy. Uh, we do need to like put some 
uh, spray foam right there, spray foam right there, and just, you know, insulate it a little. Spray foam down there on both corners because this big hole here should be filled in. I'm gonna try to fill that in. That way I can uh, sit back and relax. Because I'm gonna have a buddy heater this year to keep me warm, keep my phone warm, and to keep, keep the GoPro warm. Because last year we had problems with the GoPro freezing. So, hopefully, watch here comes a deer walking right by us when we're talking like this. <clears throat> Anyways, but we do have to come in here and cut uh, two trees down just so I can clear this property line. Right here is the property line. But uh, I talked to my neighbor. We sit, he, we are both in an agreement of six feet, three foot on my side, three foot on his side. So I'm literally hunting the property line. I got permission to hunt on his property. So we're gonna cut that tree down and then we're gonna go up all, all the way, cut them trees down. And that's the property line right there, you can see. But anyway, but anyways, so with that being said, thanks for watching. Go hit the like button, go subscribe, and hopefully we can get a deer down with that cheap Walmart crossbow. Whoop.